Uh, hello everybody, uh, today I'm going to, to show you how to create a splash page um, to your WordPress site. So uh, a splash page in fact is a pop-up that will display uh, on your page right, uh, right at the moment when the, the visitor comes to your site. So setting up uh, a splash page is actually actually very easy, and um, I think the difference between a splash page and a pop up is uh, in uh, all the cases the splash page will cover your site, but uh, that is not uh, not the case. A pop up pop up can cover the whole site or um, just cover a part of the site. So I'm going to create a really quick splash page for you. So this is make pages uh, interface of WP Lead plus X and um, I have already created a, a splash page here and uh, as you can see there's nothing uh, nothing special. This is a simple a page with video buttons and uh, this button um, usually you want to to, to let it uh, to, to set it to open um, an offer but right now I, uh, I don't have an offer so I just uh, make it go to my my website which is uh, com. Something like that, but you should. You can set this button to, you know, open an opt-in box or go to a page where you have an offer. So, uh, for example, you have this offer. You know, uh, ten step, ten steps to master uh, X, uh, whatever, what it is. Uh, X is uh, an interesting topic to you, something like that. You know, save as custom post, and uh, <clears throat> the no thanks button should be uh, should should be the the button to close uh, the pop up to really hide the splash page. So I click on the edit icon here with the action, and trigger should be click and close pop up. And this is done. And um, oh, also, you may need to set. You may want to set the the background of the splash page. So I'm going to use an image for this splash page. I don't know. Uh, maybe this one. I click on save as custom post. Now it's time to create a pop up. Which is a, the, the the splash page? We create a pop up that cover the whole page, and that will be the splash page. So we'll extra the pop ups and click on create pop up. Give a splash page. Pop up content should be splash page. Where to display? Uh, I think it should be on home page only. Position center, how to show up on after page load, and should be set to zero seconds. And after close submit, do you want it to, to continuously open? Uh, to, to open repeat, repeatedly. I, I don't think uh, we should uh, we should show it uh, repeatedly. So you should choose this. But for the purpose of this demo, I want to keep showing. And uh, other advanced option, uh, it is not needed. So I click on save option. Now go to the home page. I reload the page. And sure enough, this is our splash page, which is the page that people 
you will see when they come to your site. So you can click on no thanks to disable, disable the pop up the splash page or this a close icon here. No thanks. And now we uh, don't have the splash page again. So again, if you go to the home page, you will see the splash page here. And setting the, the splash page uh, by using this method has uh, the SEO benefit that it will not change the content of your home page. Uh, the pop-up is a part of your home page, so uh, it it really it really doesn't affect the SEO benefits of your site. And um, if you set, if you change uh, the home page to a, a completely new page, and if you your site has quite uh, quite an amount of traffic from search engine, uh, such change may badly affect your site. So uh, that's it. That is how you set up a splash page uh, with WP Plus for your. Uh, WordPress site. Thank you for watching and if you have any question, please send me an email uh, I will get back to you very soon